Okay, so first up, we're going to talk about the iPhone 11 Pro Max display. Six months later, it is still one of the best in the business, even though it still has a 60Hz panel, it is still one of the best in the smartphone industry. Next up, we're going to talk about the iPhone 11 Pro's battery life. So the iPhone 11 Pro battery life is still amazing. It still be able to last me throughout the entire day about six to seven hours. So as you can see on the screen right now, I'm going to show you my screen time. iPhone 11 Pro still has amazing battery life after six months. Next up, let's talk about the most important thing about the iPhone 11 Pro. So the iPhone 11 Pro has these three amazing cameras. I'm not sure what I'm going to say what people think. But I believe that the iPhone 11 Pro Max still has one of the best cameras in the smartphone industry. I'm gonna put up a few pictures that the iPhone 11 Pro has taken. It is amazing. Like it is one of the best cameras in the smartphone industry right now. There are a lot of smartphones that have been released. S20 Ultra, OnePlus 8 Pro, all of these cameras, Pixel 4 still feel that the iPhone 11 Pro has one of the best cameras in the smartphone industry. So now I'm going to talk about something that I have missed in the iPhone 11 Pro. So the, the iPhone 11 Pro does not support 3D touch. That is something that I'm super sad about because my other phones, when I use the iPhone XS Max, it was really a fantastic feature for me. Now when I do long touch, it is it takes a second or longer to load and you know, I don't really like that because it is really really slow and I prefer 3D touch. So please Apple, please bring back 3D touch. That would be greatly greatly appreciated. So other than that, the iPhone 11 Pro is still an amazing phone. It is still an iPhone. All of the amazing features of an iPhone is still on the iPhone. 11 Pro Max. So what I mean is that it still has an amazing OS, iMessage and all that airdrop is still amazing. It is an iPhone, it's still great. It's still holding up great after six months. The speed is still amazing. Battery life is still amazing. So if you're looking to get an iPhone 11 Pro Max now, I would say wait <laughs> because the iPhone 12 is coming out, 12 Pro, 12 Pro Max. These phones are going to show you a leak pricing right now and it seems that the iPhone 11 Pro Max and the iPhone 12 Pro Max will remain at the same price point. So 12 Pro Max will have the same price point as the 11 Pro Max. That is great because they will have improved features. Allegedly you have a 120Hz display, 5G, and a new LiDAR sensor with a smaller notch as well. So if you're looking for a iPhone right now, just hold for a little while longer, wait till October or so, you should be able to get a new iPhone with these new peripherals. And finally, I want to talk about one of the most underrated feature of an iPhone, is that it has a stainless steel body. Now what that means is that it feels great on your hand, so I usually like to rock my iPhone 11 Pro without a case on because it has this matte finish at the back as you can see right here and it doesn't absorb fingerprints as much so it's great. Something like the iPhone XS Max has that glass back which is a fingerprint magnet so I would say the iPhone 11 Pro is a great phone to rock. Yeah, the case. So that is all for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you like this video, do like, share and subscribe. Hit the bell notification icon so you don't miss the next video that I post on the channel. Thank you guys so much for watching and I shall see you guys in my next video. Take care. Goodbye.